Hey, what's up guys, Dude Tech here. Welcome back with a brand new video. In this video, I have another cool tweaks for you guys. I hope you guys enjoyed today's video. With that being said, let's get started. Lazy screen flash. So whenever you want to take a picture of your screen, you will see always that white flash pop up on your screen. But with lazy screen flash, when you take a picture, just like so, that flash will be disappeared and it's gonna be helping you a lot when you take screenshot for your eye device lazy screen flash that will be so cool if you just hear you have a message or any kind of notification and even you can listen for the notification about where's that notification came from and what it say so with speak notification that week is going to be allow you and it's going to be make you to listen for the notification is going to be came from and who sent it to you. So, for example, right now, if I receive a notification, messenger message from Slim Ness. What's up, man? Just like so. Messenger message from Slim Ness. What's up, buddy? So that's it's really cool and amazing. So if we jump to the settings here of the tweak, so you, the first thing that you need to do is just enable the button which is going to be in top here and then you can change and customize some stuff from here which is the first thing which is going to be the speak option so you can just go in there and then you have more than options about talking about speak, about notification sound and everything and the cancel button here and then if I get back here giving me more options so one of these options is going to be the speak conditions and in the custom messages and in the voice settings you can set everything from here and then you have an extra so you can go speak time here speak battery level so you can just customize all those most of the stuff here i can't go through and then explain about everything but it will give you more than options so you can go through when you download tweak you can go through everything and then set it for yourself really nice I highly recommend you guys to download it because it's really nice and a beautiful tweak for your iDevice. Speak notification. If you're still using the old hood volume of your iDevice right now, you can customize the location. Well, it's not really customized because I'm just giving you one location which is going to be on the top left, just like so. If you guys can see that. So, with that tweak is going to be make your hood top left location always on your iDevice and then the name of that tweak which is going to be the hood top left. When you download the tweak there is nothing to configure the only thing is, is going to be just change the hood volume of your sound which is going to be based on your top left just like so. Hood top left. And I'm super excited about this week here, the Lug Glyph. It has been released just last night. And then it's still, they working on it, still on beta. But it's finally is get released for the iOS 10 jailbroken device. Really happy with it. They just got released last night. And right now we are on the beta 2. So still the developer, they're working on it. But it's still working. So if you guys want to try it. It will give you that nice looking for your lock screen. Really beautiful and then so much. I'm excited about it to download it on my iDevice. If we take a look right now, do you guys see that motion on the fingerprint which is based on the lock screen? Even the sound. Really beautiful and it's really amazing. The developer are doing a good job because the last jailbroken which is the iOS 9 it wasn't like this so if we jump to the settings right now as you guys can see this is the new name for which is going to be available for the iOS 10 top on it and then this is the lock glove X so giving you more than option here if you want to jump here the first thing that you need to do is just enable the bond here and then the unlock sound so it's going to be give you two the last seven 
six seven hours it just got released with a new one so this is the classic apple pay and then this is the apple pay and this is the default theme which is going to be here so right now we are still on beta 2 but we have more than option and i'm still uh follow up with the developer about uh, the final release for the ios 10 so when you search about the log love x on the cdia well this is the only version of the log love x beta for the ios 10 log love x the up drawer so this week when you download it it was giving you a really nice and useful use for that app so if i go back to my home page here this is the icon here so when you open the icon or when you launch the application or the tweak you will be see the whole tweaks or the apps that you have in your iDevice. Everything will be based here in just that drawer right there. So it's better than to go right and left, swip right, go left, do your search. You can just launch the app drawer and you can pick the application or the app that you want to launch. Quick and fast is gonna be from here. Even you can put your favorite app, you can just pick it up and then you can add it here. So you can go to your favorites application or app and simply you can just launch that from here. If I go to the settings right now to show you guys what's going on. So you can launch the app drawer tweak with night mode and then the other thing that you can or is going to be provide you with hidden app drawer icons. So if you top here, you can just choose any one of these apps or application and just hide those from your drawer. The other thing is what I told you and I already explained is you can choose your favorite application. So top here, you can enable applications that you want to add into your favorite part on the application. And then even you can hide the springboard icons from here up drawer i hope you guys enjoyed today's video if you like the video please just like always give it a big thumbs up subscribe for my channel for more videos i see you guys in the next video this is do tech thanks for watching